Hi folks, Tiny Guitar Skeptic back with another unboxing and today we are going to be opening a Fender Jazz Style Geddy Lee uh, Tribute Bass Guitar, my first ever bass from China. Okay, so this guitar, um, let's hope it comes good. <laughs> it has cost 255 US dollars which equates to roughly 155 pounds 55 pence. The import duty VAT was 24 pounds 57 and parcel force handling fee of 13 pounds 50. All pretty ordinary, coming to a total of 38 pounds and 7 pence. A total cost in the UK of 193 pounds 62. So, uh, there was excellent contact uh, and communication all the way through with this seller. Um, they sent very good photos in advance and they uh, gave good advice over what parts to put on. Uh, there was a choice of, of types of bridge for this, uh, the standard one that most of the Chinese manufacturers put on and the correct one. I asked for the correct one. Uh, they put my logo on free of charge and I was explicit about there being no trademarks including any made-in marks. Um, I hope the guitar is as good as the, uh, the pre-communication and pre-sales was. I placed the order on the 27th of March 2015. The build was completed and I had photos on the 23rd of April, so almost a month later. And it was shipped just short of a month later on the 25th of April. It spent a couple of days uh, flying and then cleared customs on the 1st of May, uh, which was the Friday before our bank holiday, and so I collected it on Tuesday the 5th of May 2015. So, without further ado, let's get on with the, the unboxing. So, Fat Man, who is this China guitar skeptic fellow? I have absolutely no idea, but I am going to subscribe to his channel. Ooh, good idea. You know what? I might even join you. appear to have a double layer of wrapping on this. Maybe that's because it's a base. I hate the mess that these these damn things make. Yes, there is an internal layer of polystyrene, which we will remove. Crikey, uh, this seller really did not want to take any risks at all, clearly very, very well packaged inside. Their packaging, similar to their communication, is excellent. Dispense with the knife from here on in. Cable and Allen key. Now let's see if we can't lift this 
out now. Okay, I think we're just going to have to reveal it. Because this really is a mess getting this out of the case. Wow. Okay. I'll pop that there. And we'll get rid of this horrid case, like so. Okie dokie. There it is. Get rid of all the, the usual snow from it. That feels a lot heavier than the box did, which is strange. Um, it is the Geddy Lee Tribute model, and it's got two sets of pickups as per the Fender Jazz Bass but I was very explicit, oh I like these inlays, they, they're sort of like a black um, like a uh, almost like a, a black abalone or a, um, they've got a reflective feel to them which looks great um, pick guard is not fantastic I have to say I'm not all that impressed with the cutting of that it's a three ply pick guard, uh, but it's not fantastically cut, which you'll see on the close up photos. I love this edge trim detail, I think that looks great. And I'm a huge fan of the, um, the maple fretboard. Uh, in terms of markings, um, no, I can see nothing anywhere on this base other than my own headstock marking, which I asked for. The Milton Guitars logo again so that there's no trademark infringement and that's the closest anybody's got to the actual logo so far as well um, truss rod looks okay there are no obvious obvious dinks and marks on it oh, there's a couple of little sort of depressions in the paint there this is the bridge that I was told that it needed to be like the real thing. No, the 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 back of the base looks great. There's a small, very very small blemish black mark underneath the lacquer on the neck where it looks like it might have just touched with a bit of paint. Um, tuning pegs look good. All seem to work. Yeah. I am not a bass player. I'm going to plug it in and tune it up and I will play directly into the desk to give you an idea of what this sounds like. I don't even know how the, the, the three, three knobs are supposed to work so I'll work that out once I plug it in in a moment. But certainly first impressions of the overall build and quality are very encouraging. Uh, the action's pretty low for a bass, I don't know if Um, we'll plug it in and tune it up and I shall be right back. I'll give you a little bit of fast forward here. That this guitar costs 255 US dollars including all modifications which was to have absolutely no trademark infringing marks on it and to have um, the high quality um, Korean hardware attached to it. Exactly the same uh, as a, any Fender Far East would have. And uh, that includes the tuners and the bridge pickups and all of the electronics. So all those upgrades included, 255 US dollars. I paid 38 pounds and seven pence, including parcel force fee and VAT customs charge in the UK. The contact and communication with the seller was excellent. Uh, she sent exceptionally good photos in advance of shipping this out. And I have to say, this guitar looks exactly like the photos she sent. Um, I've got my logo on it. So that this is not a trademark infringing guitar, it is a tribute, a copy. Um, 
and I've got that done free of charge um, and she has been brilliant she's not put a single trademark infringing mark on it the finish is brilliant the um, the, the color I really really love the color of the inlays because they have this kind of iridescent sparkle to them which I've not seen on a base before so um, yeah really really pleased with that and um, yeah I think that the sound is, is quite nice let's have a listen I've been trying to work out what all, each of these these do and I've worked it out that that the two first um, knobs are volume controls one controls the this pickup and the other one controls this pickup and not being a bass player I didn't know that and I gather or I guess from, from working it out that this is some kind of a mix between the two or a tone control I'm gonna say it mixes between the two pickups so um, let's have a little play of it I excuse myself from from my bass playing I'm not a bass player Let's go right the way to the other side. And let's mix the two, or at least... So that's the mix of the two. Um, if I turn one pickup off completely, I should just be this one now. turn that pickup off and we'll just have the bridge pickup. I like the sound best when all three pickups are up full. I say all three pickups, all three knobs are up full.
So, anyway folks, I hope you like the sound of the bass, I hope you like the look of the bass, I hope you like it, thank you so much for all your continued support, thanks for subscribing, make your comments down below, let me know what you think of this, and I'll be back very soon with another video. In the meantime, be sure to subscribe if you like this, and share it with your friends if you really like it, and I will catch you on the next one really soon. Thanks a lot folks, take good care.